All right. <laughs> <laughs> so this video is like what? Four four months in the making. I know. <laughs> Sorry, it's all my fault. I mean, okay, so anyway, let me just preface this by saying that Jess has the prettier office. I do. Okay, <laughs> but that's not what an office is all about, just being aesthetics. So when we vote, I think we should have a system where five points are based on aesthetic. Okay. And five points are based on whether you hit your goals right. or whether the people think that you hit your goals as far as your theme, your design, whatever it is that you are shooting for. Right, start pulling out your tens for me. <laughs> so, I, and that's only because the, the ladies are gonna vote. Right, I, right. I guarantee you the ladies are going to vote. Fellas, okay. come through. I know y'all watching the videos. I know y'all looking at the pictures. Right. Y'all clicking the like, but you're not commenting in the comment section. Right. I need this win. <laughs> so, anyway. Um, that's let's, pulling for votes that, that boy, may not have put your way. It, you got a campaign. Okay. <laughs> All right. You got Biden and Trump out there doing their thing and they asking for votes. So I'm asking for votes, mm. fellas. Mm. The lady's gonna say, yes, yes, yes. They buy it. The work speaks for itself. Go ahead. Anyway, so we gonna start with her office and then go to my office. Uh, I wanna leave my office as the lasting impression in everybody's uh, mind. Right, so. right. <laughs> That's always fun in my office, cause the best. No, you say the best for last. Mm. So anyway, we'll I'm going to let Jess uh, talk about her office okay. and give y'all a tour of her space. This was right. one of our quarantine projects, yep. um, was redoing some spaces for us to get some work done. So I guess, what was your what was your design goals? What were you trying to accomplish with this space? Okay, so in my space, I wanted to do a podcast where Patrick's actually mm, sitting on right get now. Get out of the way, you do your so, thing. So to do a podcast... Um, a Jay Kristen podcast for me and work on possibly a um, clothing line for Serenity that's coming. Serenity possibly. B. No, it is going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> a Serenity B line and making sure I could see the kids from a, um, in the next room and help them with their things and staying with them. Also, I love crafts and art. So, like in my on my cabinet that I love so much that I put together, not only for the look of it, but bit for different things. So, my crafts are in these jars on both sides. Did um, you have a color scheme? I theme? love. Okay. Yep, I love doing um, art. My color scheme for so long was black and white. I just love the feel of it. I love the look of it. It's clean to me. Um, so over to my desk. I bought a keyboard that I, I I loved, but I didn't like the color. So I went to go get this one. We'll talk about where that keyboard went mm. later. But we this is my <laughs> this is my keyboard from Ezio. Am I saying it right? Yeah. Okay, from Ezio. It's a wooden keyboard with um, charcoal or black. Uh, keys and I got the because I have um, carpal tunnel I use this for that and then I got the mouse to match it um, also for my birthday I got a fan which I love so much yeah, I didn't act oh, like I oh, loved oh, it on that day you didn't act I was like a when fan. you got it this but is, you probably use that thing see more I to go to my the tour. Desk. See, I am. All right. <laughs> and then my my head my headset which. Patrick did pick my headset because he picked it for himself, a birthday gift to him that I gave him. And I was like, oh, this would be nice. End up getting that. Also, over here, this is my space to either look at Zooms for the kids or go over words with them or anything that I have to type or do. And then I have two screens, my my um, my desktop and then my um, iPad. And then back to the printer and then my drink station that I love yeah. so much. I know, I know, I know. Yeah. I know. And then, like Congrats. I said, I do crafts and I have a silhouette to do crafts. This is all my files for myself and the kids to keep track of everything. My art's been um, 
and then like my notes and different things like that and then all the other extra cute yeah, you stuff. You're gonna talk about all the stuff huh? that I put up on a wall. Ta- wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Y'all, this my this show to my office too. Lies. Cause <laughs> Lies. I, I didn't help you design? Uh, Magic. Magic. Alright, alright. You got it. Thank you, got you got thank you. you. So then my art that I got from Ikea, which is amazing, um, which Patrick put up for me. Um, <laughs> the TV that he also got me for my birthday, which is amazing to go in my office. So when I do Zooms or anything else, I can look on the screen and see it. If I'm doing art class, I look on the screen and do my art class instead of from my, de- my desktop because it's easier to see everything that's going on. And then over here is like my little reading nook. So my books that I'm into right now, so I did a relationship goals and becoming by Michelle Obama and then the pictures of all my wonderful kids and then my little journal or whatever to write things in. Um, and also on the floor, I didn't get them yet, but I was going to have one of my friends come over, um, have slippers and a little blankets for them to have if they just want to be cozy in my office. And my lights turn on. If Cecilia could turn that, it's already on. But hey, Google, turn off Jessica's office light. Bam. Can you, and then my TV the same way. Okay, Google, turn on Jessica's office. Turn off Jessica's office TV. Yeah. All right. So that is the tour of my office. Let me show you this real quick because <laughs> check out Patrick. He may not even show y'all. But back to my desk real quick. I wanted to show you my drawers, where I organize my drawers on both sides. So I organize my drawers. She is a, a, um, a theme. What's the name of that show that you keep watching? Um, um, it's just one giant container store I commercial. I can't, I can't. It's, they call it a TV show, but it's a container store commercial. You're messy. What's the name of that show? I'm There's not something on Netflix. Anyway. So she's all about the organization now. Yes. So it's called um, Organize with Home Edit. Check it out, it's amazing, I love it. You'll watch it a million times like me. All right, that's the end of my, oh, over here, this is my art that Patrick actually put this art in my, uh, (laughs) put this artwork in my closet that he made me, which is now Serenity's room. You know, more kids, you gotta take give up rooms. Okay, so let me, clarify that statement uh our baby doesn't live in a closet um when we first got married i bought well no uh, when we first got married i took one of our extra bedrooms and turned it into a huge uh closet dressing room lounge for jessica and once serenity was born we needed that room back so we turned that back into a bedroom and it's no longer a giant walk-in closet so yeah our baby doesn't live in a closet um yeah that but i flipped it upside down it's a whole different color and i made it like this so good luck and that's it mm. Now we see my amazing office. Let's go check out his. You ready? Let's go. All right. So, uh, my space is definitely smaller than Jessica's space, like about half the size. Nice. <laughs> At least you admit it. <laughs> so there's less that I could have done with the space. That said, I designed it for me. Uh, I wanted it to be tech forward. I wanted it to be open. I wanted it to be um, a lounge space. And then on top of that, I wanted to be able to get my work done in a effective and efficient manner. So those were my design goals. Um, And I wanted to uh, have an industrial feel. That was my aesthetic was industrial, um, black, brown, neutrals, copper. 
the copper tone is the uh, color that ties the rest of the room together. So that was my feel. I wanted to go for an industrial aesthetic. So this is my office uh, starting, you know, with the, like I said, copper everywhere. So I got the copper clock. Um, I have uh, my desk set up. Um, I wanted it something that reflects my personality. So um, I've got, you know, my little figurines or what have you from Halo. I've got, you know, Biggie up here. Um, got airplanes and drones and some more Halo and all that kind of stuff like that. Um, of course, I got all the screens so that, you know, hit that, that tech aesthetic or what have you. Um, Jess was alluding to the keyboard situation or what have you. This was the original keyboard that she had gotten, but um, I took it off her hands and uh, designed my room around that, uh, like I said, the copper uh, industrial feel. So uh, everything sprouted from from that keyboard. Um, then like I said, I just wanted to make it open uh, I wanted to make it a space where people could come and lounge. Jessica lied to y'all in her tour. <laughs> she said that that was her reading nook, dot, 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 whatever. <laughs> this is her reading nook right here. Is she is always in here, laid out across my couch, reading and working and laughing at whatever she's looking at on Facebook and all that kind of stuff like that. This is her reading nook over here. So that, nice. that over there, that's my tiny little hovel where I come and sit when I'm trying to uh, visit her in her space. So I got her a whole spread and she got me that tiny little situation nice. over there. So anyway, like I said, I just wanted to be flexible, wanted to be open, wanted to uh, reflect my personality. They say that you could take a person out of New York, but you can't take the New York out of a person. So. I have, you know, the New York type, uh, the New York skyline, uh, New York City skyline uh, up on the wall. I've got, uh, you know, um, different neighborhoods of New York up here on this wall or what have you. Um, this uh, console over here, um, I kind of customized it with the, um, the copper finishes. Uh, all of this was originally all black, but... Like I said, I wanted to have that copper uh, tied in. Um, Y'all know I'm a big fan of... Uh, Y'all know I'm a big fan of... <laughs> no, okay, I'm a big fan, but I don't know the name You're of the not. show. Not I'm not a big fan anymore. I guess it's off TV and I'm no longer a big fan. <laughs> uh, Jon Snow um, from Game of Thrones. Um, so, yeah, I got Batman. I'm trying to get my Funko collection up. Um, you know, I just got my books, laptop, and what have you. So, my situation, like I said, is not as involved as Jessica's, but it is what it is. I got my little fan over here again with the copper ace that. Let me tell y'all about that fans. If you guys listen, I'm not a fan of always running the air conditioning at a given time, and the way that weather is going, whatever. <laughs> crazy right now with going warm and, and cold and all that type of stuff like that that fan is a legit investment that's not that expensive so um yeah that's uh that's um pretty much my office i think i hit the goals that i set in having it you can back up a little bit so people can see that it's it's open like there's space my kids think that this is a, a a play area, that this is their playground. They come running in here. They can't do that in Jessica's office. But they sure do come and lay on that rug. They do, but they can't run like they run ahead. Like this is a whole playground do. situation for them. Every space is a playground for them. That's a fact. So, um, so yeah, my space is my space, and um, hopefully I'll vote for you. Oh, I got. <laughs> <laughs> I got one more little party piece. Okay, so party piece. The final thing that I want to say is that I can do this. When going back to that whole lounge feel that I was talking about, <laughs> and Jess is jealous of that. She's like, oh, this is it. Anyway, hey Google, activate lighting scene one. 
So I've got my whole lighting situation, all the LEDs and so forth that could change. Um, I can turn on the radio, I can say, hey Google, give me a vibe. And I got my music, I got my soothing colors, I got everything that I need to lounge and chill out after I'm done you know, a long day of work, <laughs> uh, Zoom with the kids and all that kind of stuff like that. I could just kick back and relax and uh, enjoy the lounge features of my office. So I hope that uh, resonates with the fellas because um, y'all gonna need to come out and vote. Get out and vote, both in the regular election and in this uh, situation. I need to see tens across the board. So I appreciate y'all stopping by for our tour. If you didn't watch the whole video, just go ahead and check out, uh, you know, the pictures, the close-ups and stuff like that. So enjoy. Um, special uh, shout out to Tiffany Holiday and Brittany Jackson that's already voting for Jessica. Y'all cheating and I don't appreciate it. And I need y'all to respect the man office. So hopefully, fellas, y'all show up and represent. You know, like I said, got the lighting, got the music, got everything that I need to uh, go ahead and have a good time. So, come on, lady. Come join me. <laughs> Nasty. <laughs> you so, guys know who to vote for. You know who's the best. <laughs> Go out there and vote, like you said before, in the real lecture and on this. Ladies, fellas, you know what you're looking for. I'm vote for me. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. All See right, you later. Take it easy. Peace.